these people since December and I get to meet all of them in person for the first time, so I'm really excited. Members of the class of 2021, welcome to Rice. and remember what inspires you, why you're doing this, and why you cared in the first place. Because if you can keep that sparkle in your eye, that dancing energy of aliveness and possibility, if you can keep this long past graduation, you will well be on a, your way to a magical life, a life full of love, service, connection, and meaning. And all you have to do is to live deeply and look up. Congratulations to the Rice University class of 2017. Our team is so excited to be a finalist in the 100 and Change competition. It means that we are one step closer to being able to roll out and scale up the technologies that we know can save newborn lives across Sub-Saharan Africa. Thank you for joining us on this beautiful afternoon to celebrate and inaugurate this new and exciting building and program, the Moody Center for the Arts at Rice University. What a fitting day to celebrate 100 years since the graduation of the first Asian Rice alumnus. It's a once-in-a-lifetime experience for our students. I mean, I was just talking earlier today with two of our freshmen. Can you believe this? You are a freshman, and you have been interning with the Houston Super Bowl host committee. You have this one insect laying its eggs into another insect, controlling its behavior, and then devouring it from the inside out and emerging through its head capsule. That's inherently a, a horror story that makes you happy not to be an insect and we're actually able to make something that looks like a window, but the window changes different types of colors depending on how we apply a really very low voltage. And so what we've done in this study is we've shown that we can drill into cells, human cells or animal cells, we can drill into them using these nanomachines. This is the core that we built last semester, which is the kitchen, bathroom, and mechanical unit for this house. Now we're going to move it in and save four months of construction. Flooding disaster in Houston is getting worse with every drop of rain that falls, and guess what? It is pouring again. It's been kind of mixed feelings, positive in that people are super excited to get involved, but also kind of sad in terms of how many people have lost their homes. The thing that I love about Rice is that it is an incredible community. And at Rice, we take care of our own. We make sure they're okay, and we take care and love Houston. I've been working with the team since the beginning of the summer. It's been four months. It's been an incredible time to be with the team. I mean, World Series champions. I have to say, what a wild ride for Houston this year. Let me see, we've had a devastating hurricane. We had World Series. Yes. Now we have snow, David Paul. Of course we have snow. Why wouldn't we? This is the year for everything, <laughs> right?